Hello Virgo, how are you? Welcome to my channel Star 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 and welcome to your reading. So Virgo, this is your reading for the month of November and this is a general reading. Take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Energies might be vice versa and time is fluid. Virgo, I would appreciate if you were to hit like, share and subscribe and comment down below if you find yourself getting resonated with this reading. I would also request you to hit that notification bell so that you will be notified whenever I upload the video. There is an extended reading for this one. The link for the same is in the description box and comment section. In the extended, we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you, what action they will take towards you, what is a likely conclusion between you and this person. Coming back to this reading on YouTube, I'm shuffling the cards, I'll lay them down, and then we'll see what is your energy, what is the energy of the person you are thinking about, you are dealing with, you will be dealing with Virgo. So, let's get started. All right, we have three of wands, Virgo. I sort of feel like the wait is almost over. It's been long you have been manifesting something. For some of you, you're manifesting relocation. For some of you, you're manifesting major changes in your life. Okay, and uh, if you have applied for a visa, the approval is not far away. Whatever changes you are manifesting or whatever you are trying to manifest in your life, money, love, career, success, health, it is coming towards you, okay? Uh, in fact, you are eagerly waiting for that. If you can see this card properly, the ships are arriving at the shore, right? So three of wands is telling me that whatever you have been waiting for is coming towards you and you're eagerly waiting for that. Somehow you might be feeling it intuitively as well that uh, something is near now. Okay. Five of pentacles. Yes, I told you, right? At the beginning itself, I told you for some of you, you're manifesting relocation. Uh, relocation is very likely in the near future for you guys. If, if at all you want to get relocated, it's very likely. Otherwise, I see that you might do some repairs and renovations to your home. For some of you, you're walking away from uh, relationships that are not giving you any kind of a joy. Okay, you initially thought that these are the relationships that these are the relationships, or this is the relationship that that is going to give you the ultimate fulfillment or ultimate joy that you want in your life, but. You, you are coming to a realization that whatever your expectations are, those expectations won't get fulfilled in this situation. And rather than staying in that situation or staying in that relationship, it's better to, better to walk away from that relationship. So with Five of Pentacles, I see some of you are leaving a toxic situation or a toxic relationship. Others of you, relocation is a strong possibility. I'm getting one more message. Uh, yeah also one more thing like if you if you were uh, fighting any kind of health related ailments you are overcoming that you are getting out of that eight of pentacles money for some of you money is a top priority okay um, maybe for some of you with this five of pentacles I think so you're leaving a job and you are starting something new 2024 is not far away maybe at the beginning of the 2024 at the start of the 2024 you want to launch something you want to launch a website you want to launch a business and you're working in that direction already some of you, there is a definitely a switch that is happening. You are switching from job to uh, self-employment or entrepreneurship. For others of you, you probably are hopping jobs, but improvement in your financial situation is definitely there at the back of your mind. You want to achieve certain financial goals in 2024. And you also have uh, 
you're also working towards certain targets that you have set for yourself uh, for 2023 okay and by the before the end of 2023 you want to argue uh, you want to attain those targets and that's why i see that you're you're working so diligently towards those uh, financial goals that you have set for yourself uh, apart from that i think that See, your, your state of mind is slightly different, Virgo. Your state of mind is such where you don't want to get distracted. Okay? You know what you want in your life. And I'm not talking simply about money or financial goals. Overall, I'm talking. In general, I'm talking. You know what is it that you want. You know you want money. You know you want true love. You know you want peace and happiness in your life. If any of these things are getting disturbed by certain energies, certain situations or certain people, you don't want that. You are literally, and that is why if you watch this card uh, closely, this person is working somewhere far away from the hustle and bustle of the city. You see those buildings at a far off distance and this person is in, uh, working in isolation. One of the reasons they are working in isolation is because this person is totally dedicated towards towards his work. Uh, you know, uh, giving some sort of working on those pentacles. And uh, he doesn't want to get disturbed. And that's what I see. You have tremendous amount of clarity regarding what is it that you want in your life. Okay, what are your goals? What are you trying to achieve? Happiness, peace, love, money, success. And any factor which has the potential to disturb whatever you're trying to achieve, you don't want that. Okay. So that is also one of the reason I see that you will prefer isolation for longer periods of time. In the month of November, December, in fact, I see that this might, uh, this is a tendency that will get spilled over in 2024 as well. You're going to meet very selective people. Not the case that you're avoiding people or avoiding socialization, no. But you're going to be very picky and choosy with the kind of people that you want to deal with. Let's talk more about your love life. We have Knight of Swords, Eight of Wands. Both these cards indicate uh, tremendous speed. Knight of Swords and Eight of Wands, both of them are indicating speed. Seven of Cups, I'll pull out a couple of more. King of Wands, then we have Nine of Wands, the Moon, Hermit, interesting. Okay, the zodiac signs that are popping up are Sagittarius, uh, Cancer, Pisces, uh, Gemini, uh, another Virgo, Capricorn, right? If the sign pops up, all the better. Let's not remain fixed on signs. You might see a lot of 888, a lot of 999 as well. Right, so someone is coming towards you at a great speed which we have discussed initially itself like something is your manifestations are about to become uh, a reality and whatever is coming towards you it is coming towards you whatever or whoever is coming towards you it's coming towards you at a, uh, very soon right and intuitively you're already feeling like something or someone is coming towards you uh, and that's what is getting validated by these two cards as well uh, this spread is for romance the below spread and You will date more than one person in the month of November, in the month of December, or only in the month of November. And I do see that you're going to select one person and you will, you will be like, I want to get into a committed situation with this person. Of course, you're going to feel very, you're going to feel you'll start having strong feelings for that person from the very beginning itself. But because you don't want to be like, I do have options and I don't want to be like, I'm not checking out other options and I'm just going away, uh, just getting into a committed situation right away with the first person that I meet. Okay. 
so you don't want to ha- you don't want to regret later on that i wish i would have checked other people who were interested in me okay so you will go out on couple of dates but yes you will have this undeniable attraction towards this one specific person and there is a lot of passion over here tremendous amount of passion over here you're going to enjoy sex um you're going to have amazing intimacy with this person uh but remember one thing virgo like don't isolate yourself too much that this tendency of going into your cocoon or isolating yourself uh might even continue after you get into a connection okay at least have some time to spend uh, at least have some time to interact with this person deal with this person you'll have to spend some time with this person if you want this connection to work out okay so i mean be picky and choosy with whom you want to spend your time but if you're feeling like this person is the right one for me make sure that you're spending reasonable amount of time with this person I'm hearing something might happen around full moon or new moon. Moon cycles are very important, so something might happen around full moon or new moon. Whoever is coming towards you is very ambitious, is very passionate. Uh they are perf- they are in fact a perfect match for you. I see two like-minded people coming together. I also see both of you as a power couple. Uh you will have very strong chemistry and it will be visible to the world even if you try to hide that you will be kind of unsuccessful in doing that so during the initial period of this connection i would suggest keep it as a low profile do not share or do not talk much about this connection when you are starting off with this connection when you are still building the foundation for this connection don't talk much about this connection okay uh if you really want this connection to go on for a long term on a long term basis and this person is coming across as a a mature person an awakened soul there there is a possibility of an age gap cannot deny that and maybe this is going to be an online connection because there are so many one cards cannot uh it there is a strong possibility that this is going to be an online connection all right i hope this resonates hit like share and subscribe comment down below the link for the extended is in description box and comment section in the extended we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you what action they will take towards you what is the likely conclusion between you and this person All right. If you're interested in personal reading with me, the details of the same are in description box and comment section. Take care. Have a great time and bye-bye, Virgo.